Hello guys! Welcome back to my channel. If you're new in this channel, you're welcome. If you've been there, you're also welcome. Thank you for supporting me and thank you for tuning in. My name is Warema. In this video, I'm going to react to Lily Pope's TV. My last and final thought. Like this video, subscribe. Turn your notification on to get notified anytime I uploaded my new video. Let me take you straight into the video. Like what I say is not by force for you to do it. I'm not God. I just say my thoughts. And if you know that what I say inclines with you and your understanding, then I am talking to you. But if you know that what I am saying does not, is not by force. God gave a rule in this world, yet all of us are not keeping it. So my simple word cannot come and make you to be... No. If we obey everything we'll hear without filtering it and taking the one we want, the world would have been better because all of us will be faithful to God and keep the commandments. I just said what works for me. And I can still say it 50 times. In, in fact, 5 million times again. Every man cheats. This is my own understanding. It must... Yeah, guys. She's just saying her opinion. She's just saying what she feel like. You people shouldn't bash her opinion. She just say what she feel. Yes. So everybody get their own opinion. Though not all men cheat. Trust me, not all men cheat. You know, but if we say like 100%, 50, yes. We say half, not all. Yeah. It must not be yours. If you know that your husband does not cheat, it is left for you. Me, I don't know if my husband cheats. I don't know. But to me, every man cheats. And why I want to make it circle is, if per adventure, God forbid, I catch my husband cheating tomorrow. Uh -huh, this one, I don't get the knowledge. Say, mm. Anyway, Sha, I know before. I will, it will be easier for me to forgive. But when I stand and say that my husband does not cheat, and I'm proud to cover myself and say that my husband does not cheat, if he cheats, <laughs> I will go and drink, snipe, and die. And my brothers and sisters, I cannot do that. So I rather fool myself. To my own understanding, what she's talking about is like divorce or taking things more serious than ever when you cut your husband cheating shouldn't be the best option. Yes, if you listen to that video carefully, yes, it's better for you to understand that this is the life men live. Yours might not be living it, mine might not be living it, but most men, they cheat. Even though they pretend like, oh, they are innocent when they come to the house, yes, but when they go outside, you're not with them, you don't know what goes on, you don't know what they've been doing there, even some people live without their family, don't know how they've been living you know most men they live in the diaspora and their family is back home so you see believing those wrong things yes because it will help me to forgive tomorrow as nobody knows tomorrow so men cheats every man that i know cheats including your husband you that is saying that your husband does not cheat he cheats piaisi na war you know yeah piaisi na war so i just want to clear this here a lot of misunderstanding to this. If you know what I said is not good, because waka pass, you mustn't drop in this, drop it in the comment section. Eh? I said my own mind. You reason them. If you know enter, eh, throw them, drop and there, waka they go. Simple. A lot of people, even content creators, watch this video who did not accept what I said, but they will not comment because it's not by force to accept what Lily is saying. I did not keep rope or chain on anybody and say you must accept it. And for the single ladies who are commenting that you can never marry a man who cheats, mm, I wish you what you wish yourself. Remain your single. Enjoy your singlehood. Wait for that man who does not cheat. You will find. Guys, in this video, I'm not saying something bad. Although she's just saying that men cheat. Yes. We all believe that men cheat, as well as women. Not only men. Men cheat, women cheat, but not all. 
as I was saying, what I understand is like she just saying, just assuming that she caught her own husband cheating. She's not gonna take it serious, not like because she knew already that that is what is in men's DNA. It's not like she'll just be maybe she pretend like her husband is not cheating, then she just caught the husband cheating. You know, like she's not gonna take it light. She just saying her opinion. Find him. Oh, uh -huh. The clock is waiting. Oh, the, oh, it's not moving. It's waiting for you. Continue waiting. You will find him. So I just want to clear this here. I still maintain. I talk about myself. I always say this. Some people will not relax and watch. Just little line that will get them angry. The rest, they will not want to concentrate. You will, they will just be reacting angry. Relax. Get the full point before you react. Eh? I said my own thoughts. What my father said, men that I have seen around me, I have never seen a man who does not cheat. And I am willing and ready to forgive whenever my husband cheats. I cannot leave a side chick to come and take my husband from me. Mbao, I will not. In this one that she said that she will never leave a, child, a side chick to take over her husband, I supported that. That's right. Because if you think, if you see this generation now, too many divorced, too many homes scattered, too many people like leaving their family, even people that have finished having children, they divorce. You see, mother staying separate, uh, father staying separate. Please, guys, we need to give it a thought. Yes, we need to think twice to see that divorce is not the answer. Divorce is not the key. So we now have to accept whatever situation that comes our way. No problem. I cannot finish him alone. Uh, this is my mentality. Get your own. I'm done. For the men, I just want to read this Bible verse for you. Hebrew 13 verse 4. And it said, marriage should be honored by all. Marriage is between two people, which is the husband and the wife. And God is saying here that marriage should be honored by all, which is me and you. Me and my husband. And the marriage bed kept pure. For God will judge the adulterer and all the sexually immorals. That's it ends here. God would judge all the adulterer and all the sexually immorals which are the sexually immorals are the single ones but the adulterer god is the one to judge them for believing that my husband cheats which i have never caught him before god will not judge me for believing it it's not a sin for me to believe it so get it to your head I, i'm free to believe what i want to believe Believe what you want to believe, okay? The to my own understanding to Lily Pope's TV, she's just saying in her mind. She's just keeping herself ready in case of tomorrow, in case of what comes out in her marriage. You know, she's just giving herself like a hope. Like eventually if, her, if she caught her husband cheating, she's not going to divorce. Ah, I really like that inspiration, trust me, you know? Because I myself, I believe that divorce is not the answer. Divorce have ruled so many marriage. Cheating have ruled so many marriage. Cheating have led so many marriage to divorce today. This is my belief. It is not written in the Bible. Do not believe that your husband cheats. If you believe that your husband cheats, it is a sin. I believe that he cheats. It is between him and his God. And it is God that will judge him. Husbands, I want to focus this on those husbands that are like They cheat with impunity A lot of them They cheat in your presence They bring women in They rub it in your face Please go and read this Bible verse Meditate and talk to yourself If I catch my husband cheating Will I ever feel comfortable to open up my legs for him to go in again? Like, imagining it, <laughs> I know that if he's making love to me, I will just be thinking, is it not this the same Odogu that he pulled out from someone else that he's putting inside me? And these things can break heart. I can never stand a cheating man. I cannot. 
I can never, never stand a cheating man. I might kill you. I'm telling you the truth. I might kill you. And this is why I know that my heart, <laughs> my heart, the, uh, just to finalize the video, it's not good to cheat. Both man, woman, in a family of husband and wife living together, two of you need to respect each other, respect each other's opinion, respect each other's culture, respect each other's way of, ways of life. Yeah, to make sure that you understand yourselves, you know. Because when you understand yourselves, things will work out well. When you respect your husband as a wife, things will work out well. When your husband respects you, things will work out well. So we need to keep praying because I believe that we women, our work is to pray for our men. One, we pray for them for success. We pray for them like for to God to make them to avoid temptation because what is out there, all those baby are called them. They are ready to scatter marriage, my sister. We shouldn't, we shouldn't allow them. We shouldn't give them chance. So my opinion is not diverse. Please, whatever that comes your way, you stay and sort it out. I hope you like this video. Subscribe to my channel, Life with Marema. Bye-bye. See you soon.